Sam, look. I trust you, okay? As the gang is my witness, I want you to do it. Whoa, major kissy face with Hazakoff on page 43. You're not doing it, you're not doing it, you're not doing it. Tony, calm down. Remember, it's only acting. Yeah, this is no different than CPR with Veronica Sanderson. Well, that was different. It was a matter of life and death. <laughs> Tony, that is such a double standard. It is not a double standard. It's just Tony's a guy and Sam's a girl. Oh, it's almost a double standard, but I'm cool with it. Sam, just one thing. Please don't enjoy it. There you go, Mr. S. Extra starch in the collar is just like you wanted. Put it in the car. What do I look like, a closet? What are you looking at, Wimple? It's not like all I do is get his dry cleaning. I'm about to have some real input. I can feel it. Hey, Summers, about this script. See? Make me a hundred copies right away. Shut up. All right, quiet, everyone. Time for the big scene. Now, Danny boy, remember what you're doing? Yeah, I've just gone undercover to save the beach from the evil mob boss. Now I've got to defuse this bomb and save his naive but sweet, sweet daughter. And then give her a kiss. Ah, it's no big deal. It's only TV. Okay, let's take her from the top. Places. And... Action! Action over my dead body. Nobody's getting any action here. <laughs> cut, cut, cut. That's not in the script. I know, I know. Um, he's my boyfriend, and he's going to sit over there. Right, Tony? Yeah. That's going to be me sitting right over there. <laughs> okay, let's try it again, then. And action! It won't happen again, I promise. Okay. All right, let's pick it up right from where we left off, all right? Places, everyone, and action. <laughs> I did it. And with one second to spare, boy, am I good. I should have known you were undercover. You are the only kid whose mother drove him to school in a squad car. <laughs> Cut. Cut. Well, Tip, are we, like, gnarly enough to hang ten? You bet. I'm really proud of you guys. You've earned your surfer name. You are no longer Lorena. You are now Rich Fish. <laughs> and you will be known as Ferret Fish. <laughs> and you, Monkey Boy, will be known as Sea Monkey Boy. All right. <laughs> Tony, how could you embarrass me like that? Me embarrass you? <laughs> Everybody on the beach is talking about your lip lock when it has a cough. I don't ever want to hear that name again. Tony, you're being ridiculous. I am not. And from now on, I never want to hear the word cough again. So if you get a cough, you don't say you have a cough. You have a, you have a thing, and you take thing drops and thing medicine. <laughs> Tony, listen to yourself. Sam's not your property. Yeah, she's your girlfriend because she chose to be, not because you're making her. Did you hear that, Tony? Dan and I are just friends. Can't you get that through your untrusting skull? Okay, okay. Maybe I was just being a little silly. How about we go to a movie, huh? Just you and me? I can't. Dan wants to talk to me about my career. I'm meeting him at Sharky's. Oh, no, you're not. You're not moving one inch. No way, no how. Oh, yes, I am. Don't you walk away from me. Don't you walk out that door. <laughs> Well, uh, don't, don't forget to buckle up. Yeah, that's Toner. Man, now what am I going to do? What every other red-blooded American guy would do. Get in disguise and spy on her. Sorry, <laughs> these are totally ridiculous costumes. What were you thinking? Yeah, I tried to get something less flashy, but... They were all out of the Power Ranger suits. <laughs> ooh, ooh, there they are. All right, now follow me and try not to stand out. <laughs> Isn't this great, Sam? Huh? No cameras, no crews, no directors. No jealous boyfriends? Yeah. Well, don't worry about that. I see it all the time. 
I mean, a guy would have to be crazy not to be protective of you. Protective is one thing, but he's really been a doofus lately. Yeah. If she thinks you've been a doofus lately, she should see you now. <laughs> Shut up if I bite you. Well, you've been doing great, Sam. I think that you've got a real future. Really? Thank you so much. Uh, it really was about a career. I should have trusted her. Come on, let's get out of here. I'm starting to get a rash under my fin. <laughs> now, Sam, there is something else. Freeze those fins. You know the first time I saw you? Well, it was like, bang, magic. I mean, that's why I cast you. Thanks. I guess what I'm trying to say here, Sam, will you be my girlfriend on and off camera? So, boy. Yes, yes. All right, all right, here we go. All right, Tiffany. Danny boy, just put Mr. Big in jail, making the beach safe for law-abiding surfers once more. <laughs> and after Sam's line, we cut to you. What do you say? Cowabunga, dude. Got it? Good. And only one of the surfers, you step up in your chair. Got it? Good. Right. Places, everybody. <laughs> Boy, I'm nervous. How about you guys? Oh, nah. I've been on TV before. The cameras at 7-Eleven don't count. <laughs> oh, really? Then I am nervous. Don't worry, you guys. You've got that surfer stuff down. Besides, I'm the one with the line. Now relax. <sighs> hey, Mr. S. Mm. I've done all your stupid errands. You could at least listen to one of my ideas. Here's an idea. Coffee, no sugar, a little half and half. All right. <laughs> That's it. All right, you should listen to me. I mean, I mean, has a cough, just stared down a great white, commandeered a helicopter, and parachuted under the roof of Sharky's, right? Yeah, so? So look at him. His hair's not even messed up. I mean, you could at least untuck his shirt. You don't know what you're talking about. Now, go pick the raisins out of my bagel. <laughs> go pick your own raisins. I quit. <laughs> hey, Danny boy, brainstorm. Let's mess up your hair and untuck your shirt. Much more believable. It's a great idea, Marty. Well, yeah, that's why they pay me the big bucks. <laughs> Okay, guys, deep breath. Remember, we're surfers. We feel no pressure. <sighs> okay, everyone, places, and action. <laughs> the beach is safe. Your dad's in jail. My hero, let's dance. <laughs> Too late, it's over. Cowabunga, dude! Forget it, Tiff, you blew it. Cowabunga, dude! Cowabunga, dude! Too late, ha ha, we're done. Hey, me, just back off, man. I play a guy who knows karate. Tony, please don't make another scene, okay? Don't worry, Sam, I'm past it. I know about you, too. Must have been dreaming when I thought I could compete with a TV star. But, Tony, I... Oh, Sam, please, don't say a word. It's over. I know I'm doing the right thing. You know he's right, Sam. Sam? What are you doing here? I live here, remember? Oh, yeah. Well, I just thought you'd be out celebrating with your TV star boyfriend. Dad has it all. Listen, Tony, I told him no. I love you, not him. Why would I want some super hunky TV star when I've got a furry ticket to Wicks World? Really? You mean that? Of course I do, you big idiot. Hey, I may be a little jealous, but I'm not an idiot. Tony, when you love someone, you have to trust them. Otherwise, you have nothing. That's the part that really hurts, that you didn't trust me. I know. I'm really sorry. Relationship is built on trust. And I know that now. We'll know this, too.
Morris, Schindler's List, tomorrow night on NBC. The list is life. The story is about Schindler. We were in the background. We were the people who he tried to some way save. One man can make a big difference. Give a hope. We stick with him, then we have maybe a chance. And...